Jack, welcome to Dundee United. How pleased are you to be sitting here as a Dundee United player? Yeah, obviously I'm delighted to get over the line um, and finally sign. Um, raring to go up here. Did it take much convincing to make the move up north? Uh, not really, no. Obviously, I had a conversation with the, uh, the gaffer and instantly I knew um, it's the right move for myself. Obviously, it's a massive club um, with high expectations this season, so um, it was something that I really wanted to do. Obviously, I love football, so I've always um, seen English football, Scottish football. Um, so, but obviously, it's the first time I've been up here, so it is also a bit of a learning curve for myself. Um, but something I'm thriving to uh, to get started. And you've uh, you've had a chance to to train this morning, meet some of your teammates. So, what are your impressions of the the training facility as well? Yeah, obviously they're exceptional here. Um, that was one one reason. Um, I wanted to come up here um, to have facilities like this, the, the pitches, um, obviously the ground, um, and they've even got like an exceptional gym in there that we've been in this afternoon. Um, it gives me the tools to, to come up here and be the best I can be. Mm -hmm. The goalkeepers have usually got a tight bond anyway, but I guess that gives you the chance to lay the foundations to, to have that tight-knit community as well. Yeah, it was great to get straight on the grass. Um, obviously, you've got the GK Union, so uh, it's good to... Uh, get to know them and get a session with them this morning. So yeah, really enjoyed it. If we just have a quick look at your career, most of it's been spent kind of fighting for promotion at a high level and that experience is going to come in handy this season. Yeah, obviously I've had two promotions in my career. So obviously I know what it takes both on the pitch and off the pitch to uh, be in a winning team. Um, so obviously I will bring that experience up here um, and obviously use that and and try and help the, t help the team. Mm -hmm. Your form at Barnsley uh, got you a brilliant move to, to Luton for yourself. You've picked up a wee injury, so you've not quite had the chance to kick on there, but um, I guess you'll be excited at the prospect of having that opportunity to play some regular senior football. Yeah, that's the main thing for me. Um, obviously, I haven't had that much football in the last six months, um, so to come up here and to play week in, week out, obviously was a massive factor for myself. I guess there's also an incentive for you personally if you you have the season that you hope for here, you can go back to, to Luton and kick on and try and challenge for the number one jersey in the, the Premier League as well. Yeah, for me, obviously, there's high expectations at this club this season. Um, that's one reason we want to come here. I'm a winner. Um, I don't like losing, whether that's in training, whether that's playing a game with my dad. It doesn't matter, Like I, I want to win. Um, so, obviously, like I said, there's big expectations. Um, I understand that and I've come up here to be a winner. So, um, Obviously, I hope it's going to be a good season. Mm -hmm. We've got our uh, last bounce game tomorrow against Motherwell at Tannadice and then straight into the competitive action. We've got the, the League Cup group stages. I take it you're fit and ready to go for them? Yeah, obviously. Um, I, th I prefer that to go straight into um, a competitive match. is much better than, obviously, pre-season. I know you've got to get the fitness, but there's nothing like... Um, a proper match which is there's something on it that will give you the opportunity to meet the fans for the first time so you must be excited for that one yeah obviously i've heard a lot about the fans like i said massive club massive fan base um so i'm ready to meet them and uh, play in front of them and hopefully do well for the club